Attending a community college is seen as more of an affordable option for students who are seeking an associate's degree or a pathway to a four-year degree. That option could become even more affordable if Pennsylvania's Governor Wolf has his way. Eyewitness News reporter Mark Hiller explains the governor's higher education budget proposal pitch. At roughly 5,000 strong, more students attend Luzerne County Community College than any other community college in northeastern Pennsylvania. Students like Jody Hahn. I'm seeking a business degree. When it comes to the business of paying for higher education, student bills can pile up quickly. It's why Pennsylvania Governor Tom Wolf proposed $8 million in grants for community college students in his 2019-2020 fiscal budget. Eligible students would receive a $2,500 grant to help pay their tuition or pay down their student debt. It would be wonderful opportunities to further my education and not have to worry about the debt that I'm racking up. It would give freshman student Cassandra Thomas some financial flexibility. That would mean that I'm able to go ahead and take the grant that I'm fortunately given and be able to push it off and use it when I go to Bloomsburg. To receive the proposed grant, community college students would have to graduate with an associate's degree or other industry recognized credential and remain in Pennsylvania to begin their careers. If you're willing to put your newly acquired skills to work here in our Commonwealth, the least we can do is help you avoid carrying around a crushing burden of student debt. Pennsylvania has the same number of community colleges, 14, as it does state universities. In an era where funding isn't always equal for both, this is seen as a significant increase for community college students. My impressions are that the governor is being very supportive of workforce development in Pennsylvania, which ties in exactly with what the mission of, of community colleges is. A financial incentive that if approved by state lawmakers could help many of Pennsylvania's 300,000 community college students and the Commonwealth where they'll work. In Natticoke, Mark Hiller, Eyewitness News. And while the proposed budget would provide grants to community college students, it does not provide for an operating or capital funding increase for the colleges. The Pennsylvania Commission for Community Colleges expressed disappointment and want state lawmakers to boost funding.